Hey everybody, welcome back to Dang Hippies. Today, I'm gonna show you how to fight a bear with your bear hands. And it's gonna be pretty cool. There's, it's gonna be like 10 steps, each one 30 minutes long. You, you're gonna have a heck of a time. And, oh, sorry, uh, couldn't help but notice that. My, my dog is playing in the dirt. Oh, man, <laughs> looks like he's having fun. But boy, is he, he messy. Wow, you know, he, he's so messy. I, I need to give him a bath. Uh, change of plans guys today I'm gonna teach you how to di give your dog a bath so this old lively boy's name is Haas and uh, he's a wiener dog if you couldn't already tell um, he's he's about uh, 15 years old been with me for a mighty long time you know hopefully he's got some some good years in him left and uh, yep today we're gonna wash him wash him right up all right, so the first thing you're really gonna do, set down your dog somewhere where it won't run away. And keep a close eye on him. And turn on the uh, the water hose. All right, there we go. And just, oops, that's a broken right there. But just get enough uh, water flow to where you can just hose them right off. Yeah, this won't clean them all the way and you're gonna have to turn it over too like that But it will get most of the outside uh, grease and grime off You know uh, To where you can you can really work with whatever else so just uh, hose them right off and then reach up here and turn the water off Because I mean, you know be a great waste of water if <laughs> you gotta let it run the whole time. <laughs> and there he is. Not you know, there's still some dust here and there, but uh for the most part you can you can I mean you can wash that off uh, elsewhere. So now we're inside in a more controlled environment. Uh we got a big sink here where we're gonna be washing most of the stuff in. So we're gonna set him down. Uh he he old Haas can barely fit into this one. Uh, if you have a dog that's uh, any bigger, don't have a sink like this or something, outside will do fine. It's really just about your preference, size of dog, and stuff like that. So up next, we're gonna we're gonna make a little bit of a formula kind of thing for him. Uh, so first off, we're gonna uh, put some rid uh, flea tick, rid flea and tick from Hearts Ultra Guard. Put some of that in there. Um, uh, that that's about the good size. I never really like to measure much. Um, you can do how you will. Put in a little dish detergent. Lemon scent is usually my uh, best choice. You know, so, have them smelling like a dream. Next up, you got some uh, French's mustard. Um, you know, used to say if you if you fed them uh, egg. It would, you know, like brighten up their coat. Uh, well, uh, mustard is the new egg nowadays. Uh, it's a food product. I'm sure it'll do the same thing. Um, now we got some Comet, 20% uh, more. I always get the 20% more because, I mean, <laughs> what are you doing with 20% less? Am I right? Some bleach powder, I guess. So you're gonna... That's about right. Uh, up next, we got some uh, shaving cream, and uh, not too much, not too little, just enough to kind of brighten up the brighten up the the uh, skimp in their eye. And then you got some uh, laundry stain remover, it removes all those stains from those uh, annoying, disgusting dogs. So you're gonna mix all this together. Uh, don't worry, it won't explode. Uh, and then, gonna bring it over here, and just put them inside, like that. Kind of roll them around in it. It's all right. This is all organic, by the way, so it's it's totally fine for him to consume. Just kind of rub it around like you're marinating some sort of food. <laughs> of course, you couldn't consider Haas food. He's just a plain old dog. Just just rub it into uh, the coat, and. Uh, Avoid the eyes, cause it, it still can cause a little bit of a, 
uh, an annoyance, you know, to them. So then you're gonna just, you know, rub it in and come up here, get some steel wool, just kind of scrub away all the um, impurities, just like that. It's pretty, uh, pretty simple. I, I mean, most people can do it. He's a little slippery here trying to get away, but uh, for the most part, they stay pretty calm. So then you can turn on the water. I usually like to use cold, um, like half, half cold, half heat. Make them feel as comfortable as possible. And just wa wash them right off. Just like that. So, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Man, I wish I was given this treatment as a child. So, as you can see, uh, he's a little bit wet, and with him jumping around all, all, all the time, look at him, he's a high percent of a gun. He's gonna get water everywhere. Um, I'm just gonna dry him off, get some, any kind of, excuse me, wash rag, and uh, just dry him off to where he, he won't be causing the trouble, any trouble. Uh, yeah. Still got a little bit on him, but he's dry for the most part. Uh, so as you can see, we have some scissors here. Uh, um, we're just going to trim his nails, groom him a little bit. I'm not an expert, but you know, I can tell when it needs cutting. So you're just going to trim off the, the very tip right there of each individual nail. Kind of delicate right now he's being good uh old hoss here being a good boy we got we got it uh oh there's another one just at the end there missed it oh. settle down boy settle down this is all right not gonna hurt you oh there we go and just off it comes all right now there he is all groomed, looking nice and pretty. That's a nice dog right there. Good old Haas. Let's let's see it. Let's watch him go out and play. So here we are outside. Old Haas is as good as new, and as you can see, Tater's already worked up. He's ready to play with old Haas. He's been away for too long, as you can see. See, look at that. He's all jumping around trying to get on my arms. But I'm I'm gonna go to a more clean place. Look over here in the middle of the grass. So he doesn't get all dirty again. So, all right, you ready? Uh, uh, I'm gonna kind of toss him to the ground. It's not too hard, he can, he can handle it. You ready to play? Go get him. No, Tater, Haas, don't, don't eat Haas, Tater. He ate Haas? Oh, Tater, you ate Haas. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> after after Haas is passing I I just don't I don't know if I can do this much longer I, I think I need a break it might be a year or so before I, I ever even think about making another video I, I'm just posting this one to uh <laughs> So you guys know what, what really happened out there. <laughs> Goodbye, Haas. You will be missed. <laughs> Bye. Be sure to subscribe. Thank you. <laughs> but, uh, but, I mean, who needs it? I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to be on YouTube <laughs> anymore. But even so... Hit the like button, <laughs> maybe comment, <laughs> you know, I mean, it's not like it matters to me, but, you know, just go ahead and hit the bell, too. <laughs> I mean, I don't really care, but, uh, you know, <laughs> thank you, send donations, <laughs> bye.